Hello. Today, I, um, I was thinking about people who have passed on and things that happen. I have uh, an acquaintance that I, last night they posted that their kids were in an accident and um, and then they were posting things like, you know, hold on to the ones that you love. You never know how long you're going to have them, those sorts of things. And so I kind of was wanting to talk about something around that, but I wasn't real sure where I wanted to go with it. And I, I ended up in a roundabout way with the top five uh, regrets of the dying. So I found this article that this nurse had done where she had you know, been in nursing for a really long time and so she had a lot of insight and so she wrote this article based on um, how people felt as they were dying and the things that they told her. So the, the first one was, the top, first top regret was that they um, didn't have the courage to live a life true to their self. Um, and they, they lived a life that others expected of them instead of what they wanted to be. The second one is that they wish they hadn't worked so hard. She said that um, most of those were uh, men who worked really hard, um, but even, even the women, uh, that they also had that same thing. They wish they hadn't worked so hard and had spent more time with their family. The third one was that they wish they had the courage to express their feelings. So many of them had suppressed um, the feelings to keep peace. They had settled on mediocre existence and never became who they meant to, were meant to be. And many of them even developed illnesses based on um, the result of their bitterness um, and resentment that they were carrying. So that's, that's kind of a wake-up call. And the fourth one was that they wish they had stayed in touch with friends because in their last times of their life, they were thinking, you know, oh, well, I never talked to so-and-so, and I haven't talked to them in a long time, and thinking of people that they, they lost touch with over the years, and if they had just kept those um, contacts, then they would have them in those last hours of their life. And the fifth one was to let themselves be happier. Um, a lot of them were hard on themselves and weren't thinking about, um, you know, they realized that laughter and smiling and being happy were were more important than some of the other things they had placed in their life. So what is your greatest regret so far? Um, and what will you set out to achieve or change before you die? So I found um, 10 ways to be happier today. If you'd like those uh, tips, just shoot me a message and I'll send those out to you. And I'd also love to hear um, your insight on things that um, you would like to change in your life, um, things that you've regretted, because I would love, I love to hear about what other people think, and um, I love the insight. So um, we will see you again tomorrow.